sweetheart. Wake up, dear. Wake up, sweetie. Come on, dear. Wake up, wake up. Come on. Drink a little. Is that good? Did you have a good nap? Yes. I have, I have a dream about her again. Your mother? Yes. That's nice. We're having a picnic and it starts rain. And we went on a tree and we laughed how bad your singing was. You were laughing about how bad my singing was? Oh, good grief. You miss her, don't you? Yes. Do you miss her? I miss your mom as well. I loved her for a very long time. And I will always miss her. But you know what? Come here. Uh, come. Guess what? What? I see pieces of her every day. How do you see pieces of her? Well, for one thing, these, these little cookie ears of yours, you get that from her. And uh, let's see what else. Oh yeah, right here. You see how that second toe is longer than your big toe? You get that from her as well. You see those pieces help? It does. You know what else though? She would have hated this. What? Yeah, yeah, your mom did not enjoy going canoeing. I had to beg her to come out with me. And she would have run out of makeup months ago. Uh -huh. yeah. Can you imagine all those clothes she would have tried to bring? She would have sunk a canoe. Uh -huh. I'm glad we have each other. Me too. Life as you know it is over. Almost everything that once existed in this world has been destroyed. An infection wreaked havoc on every living creature on this planet. We don't know where it came from or how it began. We only know its result. Spreading death. Those who were infected suffered and died, but then they came back. They were harbingers of the Armageddon which had begun. The populated cities of the world fell first. From there, the infection spread to surrounding towns. Smaller cities were evacuated to military compounds, which were overrun within hours. Once the infection gets in, that's it. The only reason we are alive is that we got on the river just before the mandatory evacuations began. We took what provisions we could and have added to our supplies by stopping in small towns we find along the river. This is dangerous. Every stop puts us at risk of running into the infected. As far as we know, we are all that remain of the entire human race. This small band of survivors, neighbors, co-workers, friends and family 
on a long journey to find some safe place to live. If there is such a place. On a rare occasion, we find some enjoyment in the little things. When you are always on the run and fighting for survival, the smallest change of pace helps to remind you of what it is you're surviving for. My daughter and I are all that remain of our family. Her mother died two years ago. She wanted to have a second child, but I wasn't ready. So we waited. But we waited too long. She died in the delivery room along with my unborn son. The day that was supposed to be a joyous occasion became my own personal hell. I took the blame. I failed my family. When the infection started, I knew I had a chance for some redemption. I will not fail my family this time. Looks like a good place to stop tonight. I don't see any houses. Do we need the Dakota fire? The Dakota fire? No, there's no one around to see the fire, so we can probably get by with a regular one. You want to look camp now? Yes. Hey, base camp, we have a regular fire tonight. Okay, sounds great. Good. You ready to head back? Wait a minute, I want to enjoy the view. Okay. As long as you want to. Good job, guys. Dinner will be ready in about 20 minutes. Thank you. You're welcome. Why do we keep doing this? Doing what? Clean up these stupid cans. I mean, we haven't seen any infected in months, and we have a watch every night. I don't know why we need these damn cans every time. They're just a little extra safety. I'm sorry you hate putting them up so much. Next time, you can do this and uh, gather firewood. I'll put up cans. You know what? We're all tired of our jobs. Maybe it's time we switch them up a little, okay? I'm sorry I haven't been thinking. You guys are doing a really good job. We'll talk about it after dinner. Thank you. Thanks. Hey, you should really watch what you say. What? Well, we wouldn't even be here if it wasn't for him. 
it was his idea to leave before the roundup, and if he hadn't brought us with him on the river that day, you know we would both be infected right I'm just, now. I'm sick of the same shit day in and day out. I mean, it just it doesn't make sense. I know, we all are, but there's no other choice than to deal with it. And at least we have our lives and each other. What? What was that? I couldn't really... You're right. <laughs> of course I am. I've always been smarter than you. But for real, try to be nice. We owe my lives. All right, smarty pants. Let's go get some things. Another good dinner. I still haven't gotten tired of your cooking. I'm glad. We are running out of instant cornbread, though. Hello. Another five meals. Okay, well, I guess tomorrow I'll run to town and pick up the essential food we need. We can't run out of that. Thanks for dinner. We got dishes. Let's go. When we're done with this, do you want to read another chapter in our book? Sure. You know, in a couple weeks we'll be done with it. Do you think it'll have a happy ending? The best stories always have a happy ending. Is that so? Alright, well, let's get these done so we can read. the end of another chapter. That was a pretty funny one, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I like the reading too. I'm glad I'm reading it too. Mm -hmm. I really love it. Alright. Now it's bedtime. How do you kiss? Sweet. Five. Smooth. Super sweet and I've got to go to town. I've got to get some supplies that we need. I need you to stay here, do what you're told, and you need to do some schoolwork while I'm gone, okay? Do you have to go? Yeah, it's my turn. I'll hurry though. I'll try to be back before dark, okay? Okay. I love you. I love you too, Daddy. Hey, whose turn is it to go with me? It's mine. Did you get enough rest? I slept in between shifts. All right, well, 
Let's get ready to go. I'd like to be back before dark. Bye, Daddy. Bye, Jack. Test, test. We don't want to forget this. Come on. Let's go have a little girl time together. Do you think Adele will be okay? Of course. He's a very safe guy. He knows what he's doing. He'll be back tonight. Now, what do you want to do today? I was thinking maybe we could wash your hair. But we've been out for shampoo for weeks. That's okay. We'll use regular soap. Won't be as pretty, but we can't have you running around here unwashed on Girls' Day. Let's do this. All right. You go get ready, and I'll heat up some water, okay? Okay. Bye. Thank you for washing my hair. It's so clean and I smell good. You're welcome. Everyone deserves a little pampering every now and then. Who's gonna pamper you? Oh, I don't know. Maybe you can wash my hair next time. <laughs> my, sh my mama's here and your daughter was here. I only knew her for a little while. She was always sweet. And we were best friends. She was a sweet girl. She liked you a lot. She came home the day we saw you and your dad at the playground. She told me that you two were going to be best friends. <laughs> she couldn't wait every day when she got home from school to call you, tell you how her day went. And then one day, she didn't want to use the phone. She went and laid down in bed. And that night she didn't want her supper. The next morning I knew something was wrong. A little over six months later she was gone. It was so hard <laughs> seeing her suffer. Sorry about bringing her up. <laughs> it's okay. You miss her too. And you were her best friend. So we'll talk about her again sometime, okay? Mm -hmm. That's all for now. I'm glad you're with us. I am glad that I am with you all as well. Thanks for having girl time with me. You're welcome. You go start on your schoolwork, okay?
Okay. Sounds dry. Daddy! <sighs> we found some. Let's see here. We found some deodorant. <laughs> I thought you guys smelled less horrible than usual. Yeah, yeah. We found some more toothpaste. We found some shampoo and even some conditioner. And we found some razors. <laughs> yeah. More instant cornbread. Enough to last several weeks. I know, I know, but it's good to have. Better than nothing. Better than nothing. And, uh, some spices. Oh, That'll oh help. God. Yes. Wow. This is unbelievable. Thank you, guys. Oh, uh, one last thing. We got you ladies some nail polish. <gasps> <laughs> Just oh, my color. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Did y'all run into any infected? No. The town was deserted. There were signs everywhere about the forced evacuations and that anyone caught looting would be shot, but not a living soul. Well, I'm beat. We saved you some supper. Thank you. Thank I'm hungry. You. Oh, it's good to be back. Oh, and uh, you got one other thing. Close your eyes. Again. Ready? <laughs> oh. You've needed some new crayons and something to color on besides my canoe. probably go read another chapter in our book and then go to bed because we're going to be leaving tomorrow after breakfast, okay? Okay. Hmm. I missed you. I missed you too. <laughs> it feels a lot better. Thank you. Good job. Can we keep going? All right. Let's go.
you make me feel so old. You just took 10 years off your life. I'd say so. I've needed to shave that mess for a long time. Eh, I could use a good shave, but I figure, what's the point? Yeah, that's true. Who are you going to impress out here? It's certainly not some baby face like you. Uh, I guess we should get going. Yes, sir. All right. Y'all ready to go? All right. What is it, sweetheart? What's the matter? I can't sleep. Why not? I don't know. I just can't. Oh. I'm sorry. Are you scared? Yes. Oh. Well, I'm here for you. It's okay. It's a nice, cool night tonight. Stars are out really bright. So what was scaring you? Okay. Good night. Guys, I'm back. What'd you find? I think what we've been looking for. There's a dam ahead. So if we keep going, we're gonna have to get out and take all of our supplies around. But I don't think we have to. The entire area ahead is fenced in. There's an old powerhouse at the dam that's not working. But the best thing, there's a cabin with beds <laughs> and uh, it's within the fenced in area so we paddle around this curve there's a little alcove we take the rafts out we take the canoes out we'll be good to go we have found a place to stay for good for good any infected no the, i think the area was evacuated before the infection arrived 
who has first watch? I do. I don't think that's necessary tonight. We can get in here, get in the cabin, hide the canoes. We should be fine. Wow, I can't believe it. We actually have a safe place to stay. I know. I've given up hope of finding a permanent home. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's move in.
Hey guys. Make sure that nothing follows you back here. Let's go. Where are we going? Uh, you and I gotta take a little picnic. Sound good? Wonder. All right, let's go. Oh. Oh. All right. Why don't you go get our book and we'll read another chapter. You made this. Don't drink all my coffee. Good morning. Good morning. Mm. Mm. Sorry I slept so late. It's okay. You deserve to sleep in. You haven't slept that well since we've been on the river. Yeah, that's true. That's true. And besides, we know how to babysit. I'm not a baby. Of course you're not. You're one of the ladies. I have an idea. How about we have some good girl time together today? That is, if it is all right with you. Sounds like a fine idea to me. I'm sure I can find something to do around here. I think I'm gonna take a walk, okay? okay. I'll be back. Hey, don't forget this. Well, where would I be without you? Have a nice walk. Thanks. Don't whip her. <laughs> I know. Is everything working? Yes. Cool. Even the bedrooms are working. Oh, good. Let's check it out. That was fast. I know. The machinery wasn't damaged. It was just shut down for a while. So everything's working okay? Yes. yes. I'm going to take care of the steps, guys. Hello? Hello, anyone else? I'm calling. We're here. Go ahead. Hey, good to hear you. Uh, we got supplies and some extra stuff, too. 
Any infected? No, I repeat, no infected. This place has been deserted for some time. So how long until you all get back? Should be sometime tomorrow morning. All right, well, use your heads while you're out there. Be careful. Oh, and uh, we now have power. <laughs> Great. I feel uh... We'll see you in the morning. Be careful. I will feel much better when they get back here. I, I wonder what they're bringing back. All sorts of great stuff. <laughs> that might have been one of the greatest experiences of my life. So did you leave any hot water for the rest of us? <clears throat> Probably not. Uh, whoa! I can smell you guys! I never realized that before. <laughs> Real nice. Alright. It's my turn. I want to smell as good as you. Is that alright with you? Go right ahead. I got all this to do. But then you're getting a shower. I crush myself. Alright. I'll get mine, then you can do yours. Take your time. Uh -huh. Oh, I will. Welcome back, guys. It's good to be back. How far did y'all have to go? We had to go about 10 miles. We didn't run any infected, but still being out there for so long, it's unsettling. You want to start handing stuff over the fence? Better idea. We got new locks, so we can use the gates and lock them back. Get this stuff down to the cabin. Let's check it out. Thank you. What did you all bring back? <laughs> well, give us a second. I'm talking to this and you'll see. Well, the first thing we got was some clothes, but we weren't sure of sizes, so I hope they all fit. And some detergent to wash them with. And we also yeah. brought some sugar. <gasps> <laughs> it's been so long. <laughs> we found coffee and tea and all the ingredients for some fresh baked bread. Oh, oh, oh. We found an abandoned supermarket filled with all sorts of canned goods and pastas. But it's going to take many trips to bring it back here. And for you, little lady. And. Guys, this, this is incredible. Thank you all very much. After you told us the power was back on, we found some entertainment and we brought back a TV, a VCR, and some movies. <laughs> movies? That sounds great! We saved the best for last. Brought back a lot of different things to plant. Watermelons, green beans, lettuce, leeks, mint, turnips! <laughs> oh, I can't even remember the last time we've had fresh produce. Let's plant them right now. Oh, bravo guys, this stuff this is great. You've blown us away. Yeah, Thank you. you like it. You're welcome. Well, how about some dinner and then a nice, relaxing night watching a movie? Yeah. Yeah. Sounds great.
Why did you leave? I'm just tired. It's not all, is it? It's nothing. Tell me. Oh, it's silly. Just tell me. All right. It's just that I kind of forgot how to relax and enjoy watching a movie. I've been on the run for so long, I've kind of forgotten how to act any differently. You'll remember how to relax again in time. It'll just take a while. Yeah, maybe you're right. Don't you think it's weird? What? Watching movies. I mean, here we are watching people who are dead, and there are going to be any movies ever made again. It just seems a little weird, that's all. Well, it isn't much different from that book you're reading. There won't ever be any books written again, either. It's up to us to create the stories now. Well, I didn't think about it that way. We're all looking for something to help us forget how much we've lost. That book you're reading with your daughter helps you. What have you found that's helped you forget all that you've lost? Well, I found... Movie ever. What have I told you about interrupting, sweetheart? Sorry. Now you were saying? I can't wait. It's nothing. We can talk about it tomorrow. Good night, sweetheart. Good night. Good night. Good night. Let's get your teeth brushed and start reading another chapter, shall we? This stuff is nasty. Hey, hey, be polite. Sorry, do we have to eat this? Ask if he doesn't mind. Can I not eat this? It's okay, I'll eat it. It just needs the right amount of seasoning. Mmm, it needs a little more salt.
Hey guys, what have I missed? The ground wasn't as hard as we thought it would be. We were able to get all the planning done in just a couple of hours. It's so exciting to be finally in one place, all together, where we can settle in. For. You were asleep for a day and a half. I've never been so hungry in all of my life. Oh, it feels like my stomach could rip right out of my body. Well, eating a good meal should make you feel better. Come here. Mm. We're safe now. He can't get us, okay? You killed him. I had to. I didn't want to, but I had no choice. No bite marks. Be a little girl for much longer. She's infected. We're all going to die if I don't kill her. No! 
right back. What's going on? She's infected. You're infected? No. no, your daughter. What? We don't know that. Yes, we do. What are you talking about? She's going to turn. She ate the fish. So? It's the fish, it's contaminated. What? It's just an idea. There's no proof. It's the only possibility. You need to slow down. What's going on? Your daughter's infected. No, she's not. What? She's going to turn any minute. You don't know that. Get out of my way! No, stop this! You haven't shown us any proof! There's not time for proof. This is the only way. I have to do this. We'll have to kill you before you ever touch her. Well, I guess. There aren't any bullets in the gun. What? The last time I cleaned it, I forgot to load it. You're lying. No, I got so comfortable here. I didn't think about it. Damn it! I knew I should have been the one to love this. You would better show us what it is you're talking about. Follow me. There you see it, don't you? I told you all, we don't have a choice. We have to kill her. No. You won't make it past your father. Okay, fine. Either we kill her or they both have to leave. You can't ask him to leave. We wouldn't even be here if it wasn't for him. No one will be here if she turns. We'll all be infected. It's not worth the risk. I agree. They have to go. I won't go along with this. Come on, we're leaving. Where are we going? I don't know. Come on. Come on. We're taking a little trip. Where are we going? I don't know. We'll figure that out. Let's get some food together, okay? Mm -hmm. Hey. All right, Nick. Hey, Nick. Go upstairs, get the bag, come right back here. Hurry. Thing that I can do. You don't have to leave. I don't have a choice. I can't stay here with everyone becoming paranoid. Well, they're, they're afraid. I mean, the whole fish thing is it's possible. My daughter is... My daughter is not sick. I just think that she could be. She's not! Okay, but you don't have to leave. I don't know what happened if we stay. I can't risk it. Come on, we're leaving. Here, you get this, and this. She isn't. I'm just trying to help. I know what you're feeling. You have no idea what I'm feeling. I'm sorry. Your daughter, I wasn't thinking. It's all right. It's 
not talk about. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have smacked you. I deserve that. Please don't go. We need you. I have to go. I need you. Please, take me with you. I can help you fight this. There is nothing to fight. I just have to get her to safety now. You have given us so much. I tonight. have nothing. And I love you. I love you. I have loved you for a long time. I have nothing left to give. There is nothing left for you to love. I am sorry. Please don't leave me here without you. Have a good time. You know I love you, right? I love you too. Bye. See you in a few days. See ya. He didn't put much of a fight about leaving. He's about to have the biggest fight of his life. We did the right thing, making them leave, didn't we? There's nothing right about what just happened. Do you think he'll come back after she's gone? No. He's about to lose the only thing he truly cares about. We won't see either of them again. What would be your perfect day? Going out in a field of wildflowers. Really? Wildflowers, huh? Yes, pretty ones. That does sound nice. Maybe we can find some around here. Would you like that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That was good. You made all my favorites. I got to start washing up the dishes. Hmm. Leave them. What? Yeah, we've always got time for washing dishes. I thought the water was warming up for the dishes. No, it's ready for washing. But you, not the dishes. That sounds fun. What else are we going to do? We'll just have to wait and see. Oh.
happily ever after. The end. What a great book. <laughs> that was a good book. And you knew it was going to have a happy ending, didn't you? We'll get started again tomorrow. But how about you read it to me this time? Okay. Sounds great. It does sound great. was the best day ever. Good night. Good night. You shouldn't find what you like except in the morning. She ate some little of fish. She just ate a bite. Can't be that much. Right? Right? Maybe if you get enough sleep, you'll fight off the infection. Maybe. Oh, oh you're so pretty. Uh, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry.
Is it morning already? It's actually past lunch. You must have been tired. I'm not tired. Are you hungry? Very. I'm very hungry. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh, let's see. One for you. Mind if I join you? Slow down. What's your hurry? I'm just so hungry. Okay, well, it's no rush. Take your time. Good grief. You finished that one already? There you go. Would you like something to drink? All right, I'll be right back. Dad? I don't... I feel very good. Come here. Think about that field of wildflowers. <laughs> I love you.
forgive.